taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lights here, we're back with another zen crypto video guys so i wanted to talk about the price of zen which is actually up about 55 percent from last night and guys if we do a measurement it's around 56 percent so the pump has come out of nowhere i expected this to continue down and it may roll over and continue down okay guys but um yeah zen crypto has put in a 50 percent 50 plus percent pump another thing is, is that it's going to be launching on pole chain and pole chain just went live yesterday or well for me it's yesterday last night okay in the early hours and um yeah a lot of people are bullish about this and jack levin is going to be launching zen on pole chain that was always the plan okay to have the pole chain version of zen so you're gonna be able to mint uh your zen nfts uh your zen nfts your 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 uh your your, your tokens and things like that. You're going to be able to do all of this, like what we're doing over here. We're going to be able to do this also on Pulse Chain as well. Okay, guys. Of course, if you do have Pulse Chain tokens already, you've got gas and so on, you can, you're can you going to be able to do that from the get-go. But until the bridge opens for Pulse Chain, um, we won't be able to, obviously, uh, uh, we won't be able to bridge funds over to, to do it if you didn't get into the sacrifice phase. And um, Pulse X will be the main exchange for, or sorry, the main uh, yeah, the main uh, decks for Pulse Chain, so that will be Pulse X. So um, yeah, things to look forward to on that. Okay, guys. For now, the strategy will be, in my opinion, to continue minting. Um, you know, on the cheaper chains because you know the gas fees are still pretty high on Ethereum. So you know, um, minting on chains like Binance Smart Chain, Avalanche, and things like that right now will be a good strategy. And um, you know, uh, also when Pulse Chain goes live. Uh, sorry, when Zen goes live on Pulse Chain, that will be another strategy too. Because I think that Pulse Chain is going to be pretty big, okay, guys. And um, you know, Jack's Jack clearly knows that, so he's not wasting any time in getting this launched on Pulse Chain. So he did mention uh, something about relaunching the contracts or something like that. I'm not sure. Um, if I can find the tweet, um, he said here, I was asked not to call Pulse Chain copied Zen Zen Classic, but rather RH. RH is Zen copy. Um, I wanted to find what he said about um, the actual relaunch of the tokens on on um, on Zen. Uh, sorry, on Pulse Chain. Pulse Chain. So let me see if I can find it quickly. Um, again, a lot of talk about this BRC20 and so on. It seems like his focus is all over the place now. That you know, he's going to jump from the BRC20s now over to Pulse Chain. You know, he's a busy man. He's a busy man. At the end of the day, I hope that it all comes together like the way that he envisions it. Um, you know, and when the X1 blockchain goes live, obviously, uh, that will be another thing to talk about. Now, I can't find the actual tweet um, which I saw the other day unless he deleted the tweet. But there was something about relaunching the contracts on uh, for Pulse Chain or when Pulse Chain goes live, um, so you can we can, you can start like from the beginning again, something like that. Um, you'd have to let me know in the comments, um, um, unless I'm tripping. I'm sure I did see something like that. I can't find it. Okay, guys, but um, yeah, in a nutshell, it's going to be launching on Pulse Chain, um, so we'll be able to uh, you know begin you know doing the whole the whole zen thing on pulse chain as well and ethereum zen is pumping at the moment i haven't looked into any of the others in fact let's just do that now let's have a look at for example m zen let's use text screener m zen polygon zen um okay that's not doing anything we won't bother okay ethereum zen is pumping um you know i think bitcoin is actually moving as well over this weekend um it's one of the reasons why the market is moving yeah bitcoin has had a little bit of a bounce so um happy days all right guys it's not just pure downside we are seeing some life in the chart okay so uh that is all i have for you for now at least it's not another bad news more downside video but um yeah zen is moving so let me know in the comments guys what you think guys do me a favor subscribe to the channel hit the little bell for notifications like the video which helps with the youtube algorithm and i'll see you in the next video